In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix and gain back the full capacity of a USB flash drive that you might have used the Windows Media Creation Tool on to download Windows 11 media. I have something called New Volume, which is a USB flash drive. It's a SanDisk 64 gig flash drive. Now watch this one. It's going to change. Watch the screen here. It's going to change from 59 to like 30. The Windows Media Creation Tool literally just like chopped that drive in half. I'm going to show you how to fix that real quick and easy. So all you need to do to get your drive back to full capacity city is basically I'm on a Windows 11 computer and I'm gonna zoom in down here and all you need to do is right click on the little window and then what you're looking for you want to find disk management once you get disk management open I'm gonna open this up and usually if you have a USB flash drive plugged in it's gonna be at the bottom of this list down here towards the bottom because over here is all your disks on your computer just make sure you find the right disk this is the one that says when I showed you in the beginning it was actually showing 50 59.63 and it changed to like 30 which is this one right here this is the windows partition that it created so we want to get back to this full capacity which is 59.63 so all you need to do is right click on it go down and you want to select delete volume and then when this screen pops up, just tell it yes. That's gonna give us a full bar here opened up of unallocated space. You wanna right click on that and you wanna select new volume. You're gonna get another pop-up. And all you really need to do is just follow through with the steps on this. Just click next, leave everything as default. If you just use Windows in general and you're just using this USB flash drive for your Windows computer, you can leave all these settings like NTFS, that is the newer file system for Windows. EXFAT is just for like compatibility between Mac and Windows. So if you're not really a Mac user, all you need to do is just leave it NTFS then. And then just click next and finish. And you're gonna see this go to healthy partition. And then if we go back over to devices and drives, we now have our right back in the beginning of the video where I showed you, it said 59.5, 59.6, new volume H. And if I click on it, the folder is empty. I can right click on that and click format from here. I can choose NTFS or XFAT from there. I'm just gonna leave it NTFS. I'm just gonna format it just because I like to do that just to be 100% certain that it's a good clean format. You can do that as much as you want. It doesn't hurt anything. You can also format this drive right from this screen here by right clicking on it and selecting format and going right through this screen here it shows you everything I'm gonna click start I'm just gonna do it again it doesn't hurt it you can do it as many times as you want it won't change anything just showing you a couple of different methods there as far as formatting now I have more advanced videos if you can't get in here and do this particular method this particular way so if you found this video helpful hit that like button and share it and I will see you guys in the next one